French liner Normandie has had her New York triumphs and her record-breaking voyages. She may have them again, but this time it's the turn of her British rival, the Queen Mary. First, the fastest passage a ship has ever made to America, and half the Atlantic record won back. Her commander, Commodore Robert Irving, sums up the achievement. We left Bishop Rock on Thursday morning at 7.42 a.m., and we took three days 21 hours and 48 minutes on the passage. By how much did you smash the record, Captain? By one hour and 14 minutes. Then the other half. The Queen Mary does it again on the voyage home. Having averaged 31.69 knots, nearly half a knot more than the Normandy's best, she docks at Southampton, undisputed Queen of the Atlantic. Incidentally, Mr. Sutcliffe, here seen with Captain Irving, was making his first trip as chief engineer on this record-breaking voyage. An even more modern way of crossing the ocean, of course, is by air. 